malingering. Sometimes a painting, like a transparent mirror, reflects truths and stories with a medical theme. It goes beyond the boundaries of diagnosis and treatment, inviting everyone to witness challenges and human conditions, and retails medical issues through artistic expression. One of the issues that has attracted the attention of medical science for centuries is the complex phenomenon of malingering. In the winding paths of the human mind, there is a realm full of mysteries, a landscape of shadow and light, where truth and deception intertwine in an elegant dance. Regarding malingering, an English artist named William Hemsley, with his creative insight, masterfully portrays this issue in a work titled A Sham, making it visually understandable to all. Known as the preeminently the painter of cottage life, Hemsley captures the charms of rural life in his paintings, paying meticulous attention to details and mastering light and shadow, evoking a sense of timelessness. Each scene resembles a forgotten memory, revealing nostalgic human experiences. In pursuit of an idealized view of rural life, Hemsley depicts a landscape filled with innocence and childlike purity, where nature is more nostalgic, and children's hearts beat in harmony with its rhythm. The sense of nostalgia and romanticism resonates, inviting the viewer to immerse themselves in the endless allure of rural life. In the painting A Sham, the subject matter is malingering. Hemsley introduces the viewer to the simple and humble rural life through the design of inexpensive and mismatched props in the background. He then skillfully directs the viewer's focus towards the central frame and core of the painting using a combination of light and shadow. In a tightly enclosed frame, he beautifully portrays a young boy intending to deceive his family and doctor with his illness. The troubled and anxious face of the boy, his simple and untidy clothing, open shoes with fruits in hand, next to the neat attire and well-groomed appearance of his younger sister, and the mother's concerned gaze towards her son, piques the viewer's curiosity about domestic issues, family relationships, and human interaction complexities. On the right side of the painting, an experienced medical doctor examines a child's pulse while processing the surrounding environment. His elegant appearance, neat black attire with gloves and leather shoes, hat, and cane on the table, indicate his high social status and dignity. In search of truth beyond superficial symptoms, the experienced and wise doctor observes the patient's narrative with keen eyes and experience. He not only listens to spoken words, but also pays attention to the silences left among family members. He delves into uncovering the underlying reasons for seemingly simple yet internally complex behaviors. Nevertheless, in the quest for truth, it is clear to an experienced and insightful physician that malingering exists within a spectrum of human experiences in a way that conceals superficial relationships, hidden sorrows, unspoken desires, and bitter truths for communication and understanding. He is well aware that deep within a calm child lies a delicate dance of innocence and deception, where imagination and reality intertwine. In those inner depths, where a child may weave a tapestry of illness not out of malice, but out of eagerness, to be understood and receive attention. In this realm, artificial signs such as murmurs and crying along with role-playing depict a portrait of pain and suffering, revealing untold fears and unmet needs through the veil of illness. Indeed, malingering is a real disease in the sense that it reflects deep mutual psychological effects on individuals and societal pressures. Those who engage in malingering may grapple with psychological issues such as maladaptive coping mechanisms or trauma history. As a result, malingering poses a complex challenge for medical professionals requiring a comprehensive approach to diagnosis that considers both clinical manifestations and personal and social backgrounds. Through careful evaluation of symptoms, motivations, and appropriate assessment tools, medical experts can effectively identify cases of abuse and provide proper care for their patients.